I'm gonna today I'm gonna talk about continents. There are seven continents in the world. They are Asia, Africa, North America, South America, Antarctica, Europe, and Australia. First, I'm going to talk about Asia in detail. Asia is the largest continent in the world. It has the biggest land area and has the highest population with over 4 billion people. Asia is a continent which is located on the east of Europe, on the north of the Indian Ocean and bordered by the Pacific Ocean on the east and the Arctic Ocean on the north. It experiences wide variety of climate due to its gigantic size. It experiences different climate such as hot, cold and monsoon. Asia has over 50 countries. They are China, India, Japan, Pakistan, Sri Lanka, etc. In Asia, the highest point on land is Mount Everest in Nepal and the lowest point on land is the shore of the Dead Sea in Jordan. Asia is home to many interesting animals including the giant panda, Komodo dragon, the Pactrin camel, Asian elephant, tiger, king cobra, etc. Great Wall of China, which is one of the new seven wonders of the world, is located in Asia. Asia is rich in natural resources, rice, fish, forest, copper, silver, petroleum, etc. Now I'm going to talk about Africa, which is the second largest continent. Africa is the second largest continent in the world, both in area and population. The largest desert in the world, the Sahara, is located in the African continent. Africa is a continent which borders the southern half of the Mediterranean Sea. It borders Atlantic Ocean on the west and Indian Ocean on the southeast. Warm and hot climate prevail all over Africa. This climate dominates desert conditions. There are over 54 countries in Africa. Examples Egypt, Nigeria, Libya, South Africa, Tunisia, Syria, etc. Africa is home to the River Nile, which is the longest river in the world. It passes seven countries in Africa. Mount Kilimanjaro is the highest mountain in Africa. The Pyramid of Giza, which is one of the seven wonders in the world, is located in Africa. Africa is rich in minerals. Most of the world's diamonds and gold are from Africa. Next, I'm going to talk about the continent North America. North America is the third largest continent in the world in size and the fourth largest in population. North America is located on the north of South America. The continent has enormous islands of Greenland, USA, Canada and other small island countries. 23 countries make the continent of North America. Most of North America experience cold in winter and hot warm in summer. Some places experience long hot summers and mild winters. Other places experience harsh winters and short summers.
the climate varies tropical rainforest to permanent ice caps NASA headquarters is located in North America Chichen Itza which is one of the seven wonders of the world is located in North America The commonly used languages in North America are English, Spanish and French Football, basketball, baseball and soccer are the commonly played games in North America. Now I'm going to talk about South America. South America is the fourth largest continent in the world in size and fifth largest in population. It has 12 independent countries. South America is located on the southern hemisphere. It borders Atlantic Ocean on the east and Pacific Ocean on the west. South America and North America are connected with the land bridge of Panama. Cristo de Lima in Brazil and Machu Picchu in Peru are two of the seven wonders of the world which are located in South America. The commonly spoken language in South America are English, Spanish and Chinese. The Amazon rainforest, which is the largest rainforest known as the lungs of the earth, is located in South America. Argentina, Uruguay, Ecuador, Brazil are some of the famous countries in South America. Now I am going to talk about Antarctica. Antarctica is the fifth largest continent of our planet. Antarctica, the southernmost continent, is an ice covered landmass. The continent is a cold, dry desert where access to water determines the abundance of life. Antarctica is the windiest place. It has the least it is the least populated continent. There are no permanent residents in Antarctica. People are mainly based there for one year to live and work in research stations. Penguins are the common birds of Antarctica. Vincent, Vincent Massif is the largest mountain in Antarctica and it is one of the most famous landmarks of Antarctica. The Rose Ice Shell is the largest ice shell of Antarctica. An ice shell is a permanent floating ice sheet attached to land. Now I am going to talk about Europe. Europe is the 6th largest in size and the 3rd largest in population. It is the 2nd smallest continent of all other 7 continents. It is the only continent which has no true deserts. Europe borders onto the Arctic Ocean in the north, the Atlantic Ocean in the west, the Mediterranean Sea in the south and Asia in the east. Europe has 44 countries. Examples Russia, Germany, United Kingdom, Italy, Spain, France, etc. Towards the western Europe it is moist and moderate climate. Towards Eastern Europe, it is it has cold winters and hot summers. In the north, it has long and very cold winters. Towards the Mediterranean Sea, it has dry summers and mild winters. Eiffel Tower. It is the tallest building in Paris 
which is in France, until 1931. Now Eiffel Tower is the symbol of city of Paris. Vatican City, Vatican City is the smallest country not only in Europe but also in the world. The Colosseum is an oval shaped amphitheater which is located in Rome, Italy. The Leaning Tower of Pisa is known for its prominent tilt to one side. It is a bell tower which is located in Italy. Now I'm going to talk about Australia. Australia is the smallest continent in the world. It is also known as the land of kangaroos. It is both a continent and an island. It is known for its vast wildlife. It is the driest continent in the world. It is surrounded by the Pacific and Indian Ocean. It shares no land borders with any other country. It is sometimes also known as Oceania. Australia consists of six states. There are New South Wales, Queensland, Tasmania, Victoria, Western Australia, South Australia. The important cities of Australia are Melbourne, Perth, Sydney, etc. The Sydney Opera House is an opera house in Sydney which is, shaped in, which is in the shape of a sailboat. The Great Barrier Reef is the largest coral reef in the world. It is the largest structure made by living things. It can be seen from outer space. I hope you got some information from my video. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.